Antimatter, essentially, is the opposite of normal matter. Antimatter has the same mass of normal matter, but the charge carried by it is opposite. When matter and antimatter meet, they annihilate each other, producing pure energy. It is believed that equal amounts of matter and antimatter were formed after the Big Bang. However, a slight difference in reaction rates produced 1 billion and 1 particles of matter for every billion particles of antimatter. That one singular extra particle of matter for every billion particles of antimatter is what created our universe. Today, there is a negligible amount of antimatter in the universe. Normal matter dominates antimatter. But what would have happened if our universe was made of antimatter? What would the planets, stars, and galaxies made of antimatter look like? Antimatter can be made in laboratories, but handling and storing antimatter offers many challenges, which makes it the costliest thing in the universe. Considering the level of technology we have today, physicists have been able to make anti-hydrogen and study its properties. It has been experimentally proven that anti-hydrogen produces the same exact light as regular hydrogen. So, an antimatter sun would look exactly the same as our sun. People living in an antimatter universe would witness the universe exactly like we do. So, does that mean galaxies made of antimatter might be existing somewhere in the universe? Although, theoretically possible, if antimatter galaxies were out there, we would see them interacting with regular matter in their vicinity. These galaxies would thus be blasting out radiation and would be annihilated completely after some time, which is not what we currently observe in space.